Tora Dora. This anime graced us in 2008, giving us all a cure for our depression and no cures for it. <laughs> I shall establish the benchmark for rom com anime and waifus. Hello everyone, so does anyone remember when I made my most controversial anime take on Toradora over a year ago? Well, we're revisiting that controversy, and this time I hope to clear up some confusion. But before we get started, consider subscribing to stay updated on all things anime as we dive into more discussions like this one. So let's address the elephant in the room. Toradora Season 2, not happening. And here's why. The series ended on a high note, a true masterpiece. However, many are left confused, especially those who haven't seen the after credits. So, if you're one of those, go check out the ending scene. And if you haven't seen the series, give it a watch. Trust me, you won't regret it. So, before we get into the main point for this video, let's talk rumours. Before anyone says something, no, there is no more plans when it comes to continuing the franchise as an animated series. Just because merch or collaborations come out for Toradora, it does not mean a new series will be on the horizon. Now, the dislikes on the video were due to those involved thinking it was useless for me to even mention another season, and those who still will wish for more seasons. The reason I made this video, however, was because I was in the middle of this debate. What if we could get something better, like a Toradora movie? Why a movie, you say? Because it is a film, there will be a larger budget and a more direct approach. I believe that a movie rather than another season would not harm the Toradora series. Also, for those like me who desired a more light-hearted finale, this would fix that problem. Now on to my version for the Toradora after story. We pick up where the series left off, we flash back to the final scene of the anime, then it cuts to modern day. Taiga and Ryurichi are on the phone, excited about moving in together. We will witness their improved communication and shared anticipation. Amidst house shopping, Ryurichi grapples with summoning the courage to propose to Taiga. As they navigate this new chapter, the ample opportunity for heartwarming moments and fan service showcase their growth while staying true to their characters. I would imagine the climax would be under a night sky, illuminated by fireworks with Tiger staring off in the distance. Ryuichi calls how he longed to elope with her, and how he referred to Tiger as his bride. And he knows now is the time. He whispers her name while holding her hands, and tells her about how much he loves her. Which causes Tiger to become flustered, but before Tiger can King lift her head, he goes down on one knee. Tiger, will you marry me? Tiger cries, smiling, and says yes. With that, fireworks go off as they embrace each other. As the scene fades, we catch a glimpse of their future. Ryuichi returns from work, with Tiger greeting him, panning down, followed by their three children. I believe that would be a true finale. And before anyone asks why three, well, in the Toradora PSP game, she gave birth to triplets, which I wanted to reference. And I feel horrible for Tiger, though giving birth to triplets must be exhausting. While I believe the series ended perfectly, there's always room for more connection with these characters. Ultimately, as fans, we just want to see them happy. So I hope I shed more light on the topic today. Be sure to subscribe for more discussions like this one, and let's keep the conversation going in the comments. But all in all, I have been Fifth Milk, and I will see you in the next video. Take care everyone.